Hey yo guys, welcome back to another video. Hope you're having a great day as always. So guys, please hit the like button and support the channel. But guys, tell me who you think is gonna win the 2017 NBA Finals down in the comment section. Warriors or Cavaliers? With the way the playoffs are looking like, cause the Warriors and the Cavs are just sweeping their way through the playoffs. So in the finals, I think it will be the two teams. So my question to you guys is, who do you guys think will win the finals and take home an NBA trophy, an NBA ring? And the other question is, who do you guys trust on those two teams to hit the game winning three? If it goes to game seven, who do you guys trust on each team to hit the game winning three? On the Cavs, do you trust LeBron or Kyrie? And on the Warriors, Stephen Curry or Kevin Durant? Of course, on the Cavs, I trust Kyrie because it's proven in the past that he can hit game winning threes or game winning shots. And on the Warriors, I gotta trust KD because nobody can really defend him when he's pulling up. But Curry, I don't really trust him that much because of his recent finals record. You know, he's always choking. He's not, he misses a lot of shots in the finals. So I don't really trust him with a game winning three. If KD really wants to hit that game winning three, I trust him the most because you can't really block KD when he's pulling up. You can try to block him and his arms can be in heaven. You ain't reaching that high to block the ball. But of course, LeBron James will be guarding KD for that game winning three. It is interesting because then, but then again, I don't know if I really trust KD that much. Because then, LeBron James will be guarding KD and he has to hit a game winning three and it's hard to hit a game winning three or a shot over LeBron. And also, if LeBron has to shoot the game winning three, then KD is defending him. And with LeBron James shot and KD's arms, I don't think LeBron's gonna hit that game winning three if the NBA Finals goes to game seven. But tell me what you guys think in the comment section. I mean, by now, it's obvious, right? That in the finals, it's gonna be Warriors versus Cavs. Cause in the playoffs, LeBron has been like sweeping his way through the finals. I, I won't say that ever again, but LeBron and the Cavs have been sweeping their way through the playoffs. And Curry and the Warriors are just unstoppable. I mean, how can you stop Curry, KD, Klay Thompson, and Draymond Green? Maybe that will translate into the finals, but right now, the Warriors are just nobody can stop them. Mainly because, well, the Spurs had a chance to give him a challenge. Of course, they weren't gonna win the series, but they had a chance to give them a challenge, but Kawhi Leonard got injured because, I mean, Kawhi Leonard is the only player that can actually stop KD. Kevin Durant from scoring 30. KD without Kawhi on him, he could probably score like 24 in a game. He could most likely score 30 when he's just on fire, but if you put Kawhi on KD, he might score like 21. I mean, KD's still gonna score, but at least he's gonna keep KD from going off and scoring 30 or 50 or whatever. But of course, Kawhi Leonard is not enough to stop Curry, KD, Draymond, and clay in the playoffs so in the finals i believe it will be warriors versus Cavs because i don't think that Zoltics are gonna stop the Cavs from going into the finals it might be a less sweep I, I i i said i wasn't gonna say it i'm not gonna say it but lebron james and the Cavs are just sweeping their way through the playoffs and i don't think that the Celtics can stop them because the Celtics rely heavily on isaiah thomas and isaiah thomas is too small when he goes into the paint lebron is waiting for him and tristan thompson and isaiah thomas his offense is mostly attack the rim but you can't attack the rim and just make an easy point because it's the playoffs players are actually playing defense lebron is gonna be waiting for you in the paint and tristan thompson so it's gonna be hard for him to attack the paint and of course at the three-point line they're playing good defense so the Celtics' weakness is that they rely heavily on isaiah thomas and he's not gonna be enough because he can shoot threes all game but the Cavs got lebron kyrie kevin love tristan thompson jr smith i mean you ain't stopping them the Celtics got talent but they don't got enough talent to beat the Cavs. I mean, in game one of the playoffs, they couldn't even stop LeBron from scoring. He was just going in the paint, doing whatever he wanted to do. Completely disrespecting his opponent. So now we're going to talk about the finals. So who do you guys think is going to win the finals? When, if it comes down to Warriors versus Cavs, which I believe it'll be. So once again, when it comes down to it, if it goes to game seven, who would you guys want to hit the game winning three? For the Warriors, KD or Curry? For the Cavs? LeBron or Kyrie and who do you guys think will win now I think the Warriors will win if the Warriors really want to win Curry cannot be missing threes or any wide open shots Curry cannot be missing like how KD don't miss Westbrook it just can't happen Curry cannot be choking in the finals like how he always chokes he gotta bring it which I think he will but I don't know I'll leave it up to you guys in the comment section tell me who you guys think is gonna win the NBA finals and who do you guys trust to hit a game winning three to seal the deal on both teams but anyway thank you guys for watching and I'll be back with some more videos and I'm out